you suppose of Edwards? Can you, if anybody knows fighters, especially today, we go right to the source. You and maybe Eddie Mustafa Muhammad, who I spoke with earlier. But how do you see this fight uh, coming off? Do you look at it uh, the way most people are, uh, Floyd, probably uh, a decision? Well, if Floyd stops Manny, it's not going to surprise me. You know, I mean, some, some, somehow people don't realize that. Floyd has a longer reach than Manny, you know. Even though Manny has beaten guys who are bigger than him with speed and agility, this yeah. this is the person who's gonna fight who has obviously got a quicker reflex. It's not so much the speed, the reflex tells you where you're going. And, and I can't see him being, you know, the quickness to Floyd. It surprises me, though. I'm glad to hear you say that because most people don't pick Floyd to, to stop him. Sure, they don't. Because they think man is quicker. Uh, they think Floyd has aged. Right. Yeah, but we've been around for centuries. Why it's all time guys beating younger guys. And he never go. But Floyd never goes for it the majority of the time. He steps to his sure. style. Sure. You know, Floyd's an enigma in his own right. Yeah. But because people don't look at it that way, they think that man is going to walk through it. Let alone, they forget that man has got a shorter reach. He has to find Floyd. And not many people usually find Floyd. That's right. <laughs> he's, he's like a magician. Floyd's a Houdini. So if, it, if man is going to find him, well, <laughs> man has got, and he has to fight him too. So he has two jobs. Find Floyd and then fight Floyd. Right. <laughs> How do you rate Floyd, uh, the great fighter of his generation? But do you, how do you, or do you put him at the, uh, in, in a select few of all time? Well, it's difficult. It's very, very difficult. I mean, you know, there's guys like Ray Robinson, there's Muhammad Ali, there's people, Ray Leonard. They, they all different. So this guy's better than the other guy. Right. We're here with Floyd this time, you know. Right. I don't know what Ray would have been if he lived in this era. Would he probably spend more time on the cell phone rather than going running? We don't know. See? Yeah. People always like to compare, but that's the beauty of mankind. Compare and then judge from there. But as far as Floyd himself to this generation, he's done it the best way it should be done. Because we used to fight, and somehow I wish we did it the way he did it. You know, whatever hours he runs, or how long he spends in the gym and work ethic, it has paid off. Absolutely. You can't blame the kid. All right, well, we appreciate it from uh, talking about uh, one of the great champions and from another great champion. Thank you, Boza. Anytime.